Right, so that homeowner was so upset, she filed a police report with Renton to police, police to make a harassment claim after a neighbor showed up at her door, not acting very neighborly at all. Anybody? I need to talk to somebody. This ring video shows what happened when a neighbor in Renton Highlands knocked on this door to ask about noise. Yeah, is that your child screaming? Yeah. We've blurred her face because she isn't charged with anything, but the homeowner who answered the door will never forget what played out. Uh, well, it's really loud in her neighborhood. I've lived here for 30 years, and he said, you guys came in? It's really loud, okay? So, uh, is it in the daytime? It doesn't matter. I mean, all day I've been hearing that screaming, okay? Okay. Yeah. My child and she's going to keep screaming. Yeah, well, yeah. go back to your country. How about well, that? Oh. I just can't believe this. That you will come to my house and insult me like that. Like, who gives you the right to do that? Yaret Lopez is the woman who answered the door. It was a Saturday, a sunny day for her seven-year-old daughter's birthday party. Lopez took the water toys and the slip and slide out in the yard where her kids can play. They were getting wet and laughing and screaming and just having fun. Um, and then this lady just showed up on my door. Yeah, well, yeah. go back to your country. How about well, that? Oh, boy. Yeah, what's, yeah. My, what's, my, what's my country? Tell me, tell me, tell me what's my country. Lopez is clearly upset and says she called rent and police and eventually filed a report online for harassment. I, I don't want my girls to feel that because we're different, because our my skin color is not the same, that they, they give them the right to treat us like that. And she wishes her neighbor approached things differently. I would explain to her, hey, it's my daughter's birthday come in. We have tamales. My mom made tamales that day, you know. I would invite her over so she, you know, we get to know each other. We neighbors. Now, we did try to talk to the woman who made those comments to Lopez earlier this afternoon, but no one answered the door. Keep in mind, with the weather improving, it's sunnier, more people are outside having parties, more people are having their windows open. These noise complaints could be going up. It's something that the King County Sheriff's Office and also possibly the city of Renton is seeing as well. Live in Renton, I'm Christine Pei, King 5 News.